Welcome back again everyone, uh, just before I start I'd just like to give a shout out to FX Channel House who made the intro that you've just seen. Make sure you go to his channel and check out uh, what he's creating, he's just started but he's um, doing a great service for people and he made me this one for free which was very kind of him and it looks great and yep yeah, I just wanted to say so. So make sure you go to the link below, I will put it in there for you. And yeah, but back to uh, the big picture of No Moria, it's episode 4. Last episode we got quite a lot done, I built some beds, uh, the great hall was done, and all of that, and I should probably click play because they've got a lot to create, I need them to make all the crates for the areas that I selected, there's a few up here and a whole bunch in here. Um, I want to start building some more work houses, why is that red? Um, or maybe it's just the type of thing that it is, I don't know. Um, I need to build some more work shops basically. So, to start with, I'm going to build a little wall off here. I'm going to try and keep it a similar size. Uh, oh, there we go. Um, this is going to be a, a basically an attachment of this one, which is going to be my stonemason room, where I'm going to create all the things that are stone. And I'm also going to make a detachment from here as well. Doesn't need to be too big like that and this one is going to be what's it called again um, a tailor shop is what I'm going to be creating there which is basically it can use my bolts of cloth then to start making clothes and things like that so that's what I'm planning on doing this episode there's quite a lot to do I'm also possibly going to start strip mining uh, this layer a layer down because there's obviously um, a lot of area to cover and I want to start finding some goodies, start making some jewellery for my my guys, and some maybe some metal, start making some weapons, to defend my kingdom of the griffins, is, is what it's called. Oh, I'm actually starting to grow some strawberries now, so that's some good news, that's a good thing to see. What about cotton-wise? Um, cotton farms not grown yet, that's okay, and my yaks also haven't bred, and I really want them to breed. Why won't you breed? Breed for me. So yeah, uh, doors are coming along hopefully nicely. I should probably get them to cut down some more trees. Because I'm running a little bit low on wood. I don't want to get too far behind and then be struggling. So I'll get them to um, just cut a line of trees here. Hopefully my tree farm should start growing properly soon. Is, is what I'm hoping. Um, I think I'm going to expand my farm as well. Um, I have a lot of strawberry seeds laying around all over here. I think these are strawberry seeds. Oh, these are cotton seeds. Uh, what are these ones? Strawberry seeds. They're everywhere. I want them to um, really start to make a lot of strawberries because it's going to be a... Uh, a big part of my, our kingdom for the meantime until I can start making some bread and things like that. What's here? There's something purple. What are you, Mr. Purple? I don't know what you are. Something purple. Maybe it's Barney. Barney the dinosaur. Okay, so this is all cut out. This is all cut out. That's good. So I'll jump into build, workshops, and stonemason. Build. And I'll put that in the corner. So that's going to be linked up to this. And then I'm also going to a tailor shop which is just going to go there simple as that hopefully this should start moving some of this um, stone or raw granite and dirt away it looks messy and I don't want it there um, I actually decided off camera that these nine people eventually are going to be my soldiers and they need to be at the top they need to be ready to defend my kingdom against anyone that attacks and what I'm going to do is, in the, la uh, the layer below, I'm going to build uh, a basic housing for everyone else. So anyone that comes to my village after this, they'll have their basic housing downstairs. Um, it keeps them out of the way a bit. So if anyone does like try to storm the fort, these guys will be ready and ready to prepare and go. I'll probably put an armory and some training facilities in this sort of area here. Maybe an armory here, training facility. So... We'll have a lot to do, uh, but that's that's a bit into the future right now. I'm I'm not I'm not ready for that yet. Uh, these guys are picking the strawberries now, which is good. 
Hopefully I have some room for them. Uh, not as I can see. Okay, so this plank's being made. At the moment, what are you guys building? You should be building some crates now. Because I'm going to need a whole load of them. I did assign a lot of them, so these things will probably be put on hold for a while. But that's okay, it doesn't matter too much. Now, I kind of want to... I'm going to need to make some more torches for a start. That's going to be an essential. Oh, they're building them now. There we go. Um, I should probably think about putting a, a second carpenter in. Which I'll probably do now if I can fit it in here. There we go. I'll put that there. So I have two of them so two people can start making stuff at a time. I'm going to be need a whole load of uh, different wood crafting. So it seems like it would be a, a good, good option. So they've built the doors there. That one's done. I've got two more to be built here for my secure house. They'll probably be changed for stone doors or metal doors later on. But that's all uh, okay for now. Um, I'm going to want to put some torches in these guys' rooms. There's just so much to do. So much to do. So little time. Uh, I've got a lot of crates. <laughs> I shouldn't have put that many crates down. Oh, I might as well get it done now whilst it's there. Right. So, there's no one idle at the moment. Which is, which is a good sign. There's no one waiting around. Stock-wise, I've got 129 food, 102 drink. Weapons, one armor, two. Furniture, zero, and storage containers, two. Okay. Okay, so you can see them putting them in now, which is good. These are all done. Good. And they're getting put full of yak milk. Tasty, tasty yak milk. As you can see, they they sort of um, automatically drop it into into holders for some strange reason. Um, It's getting a bit cluttered up here. So... I'm going to build some stairs down. I'm going to put this in my grand hall, I think. I think I might do that. Why I'm doing that, you may ask. I don't know. I, I don't have a clue. How do I do that? Build terrain. Where's stairs down? Stairs down. Okay. Um, Was that stairs down? Yeah. Um, I don't have any metal. I can make some block stairs. That would look nice. Uh, I might have to do it outside. Why won't you let me build stairs? Hmm. Okay. Um, I'll put them outside. For some reason, I can't put them inside. Um, where's a good place for that to come? Um, it's going to be hard to defend. Is the problem? Oh, um, instead of doing it that way, maybe I could do stairs up, and then go down a level? No? Oh, I don't know. There must be a way to do it. I'll, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out while these guys do some stuff. Dig. Stairs down. Ah, oh, there we go. There's stairs down. Okay. So, where am I going to put these stairs? Um, could I, I could, I'm going to have it off to the side. I'm going to have it off to the side here. I don't know why it's going to be there. It just seems like a good place to have it. It's a great hall. Um, I'm going to put an emergency bunker down there. So, there's my stairs. And then I'm going to start to dig out the walls a little bit. I'll just do some straight lines such as this. That way, they've got plenty of directions to go. I'll put an immediate bunker safe house somewhere. I don't know if it'll help because I doubt they'll run to it. Maybe a guard room down here. That could be handy, although I kind of should put this up here. A guard room would be necessary to be near the main entrance, which is going to be here. I'm going to change these doors eventually as well. But that's all in it's all in good time. It's all in good time. So there's a lot more stone. I found some more coal, which is good. I mean he dug he dug this out so fast then. Okay, what's this? What type of wall is this? Uh it's clay, okay. So I'm gonna probably want to dig that out. I don't know how much it's gonna be. Maybe I can't see there being too much. Um What I'm gonna do is I will Right here, 
this is going to be some dormitory co uh, quarters for anyone new that comes to my town. I don't want them being upstairs. Oh, I think am I picking up some clay here? I hope so. Uh, I don't want them being upstairs, as I said. It's they, they'll get in the way a lot, and they can just all sleep in a big room down here. I might section them off. I don't know. Also, I've got some clay. That's some good. Some clay clumps. I also might make a huge stockpile section down here eventually but that's all in good time maybe I can make this my stockpile section it needs to be close to the the way up hmm I'll, I'll leave it for now I'll leave it for now because these guys will be okay for now where where it is I mean this is okay the stockpiles outside don't matter too much I want to move them inside eventually but it's, it's not an essential okay so these all planted again good trees haven't grown yet all these crates have been built though. These ones haven't. So if a couple more here. They haven't built the workshops. Oh, I need more people. I need more people. How many more have I got to go? Quite a few. <laughs> I've got quite a few to go. Wow, I didn't expect that much. Um, I will put another door in though. Because I need one. Craft door. And then a whole bunch of torches. There we go. My kingdom's coming along nicely. I'm liking the way it looks right now. And, oh, I'm looking forward to the future. I'm looking forward to having to defend my kingdom. My, my entrance is quite well hidden. I don't think they'll uh, easily be spotted. The farms uh, outside won't matter too much. I may actually start to build some stockpiles down here. So, I, I, when I mean I want some stockpiles, I want some big stockpiles. Maybe I'll do another layer down. Hmm. Oh, it's, it's tough decisions all the time. What I will do, though, is... Uh, this entrance is a bit cramped. So, I'm just going to open it up a little bit there. Make it look pretty. So let's see what sort of things that I'm going to be building in the future. And I can sort of lay it out that way. So I need to build a, a kitchen. A distillery. Now that's something I want to build soon actually. Start brewing some wine and some beers. That would be good. Ooh, I kind of want to do that now. Butcher shop. I'm not going to think about that for the moment. I don't have enough meat. Uh, kitchen. That can wait as well. Furnaces. Forges. Blacksmiths, they need bars, I don't have any metal yet. Metal worker, weaponsmith, a kiln, there's going to be lots of things that I'm going to need. A market store will be good eventually. Start selling some stuff for my people. Okay. Now you need to build a lot more crates. There's one there, which hopefully someone should move in a second. Which is going to go there. Okay. Oh, right. Let's click on here. I don't want to move that, it's fine. <laughs> it can stay there. Oh, what's this? Okay. Oh, wow, my wheat's finally been done. My wheat's um, grown. Okay, I'm going to do it now. I'm going to build some stairs down. Uh, stairs going down. Here. Right in front of it. And then once that's done, I'm going to build a whole load of Warehouses down here. This could be my warehouse section. Okay. So I need a mine out a huge area down here. Uh, let's go with that for now. That that will keep them busy for a while. And yeah. That, this is going well. This is going well. So this is going to be my dormitory area. I'm going to make it a bit bigger. I'll put uh, the bar down here. And all of that sort of stuff for the people to come down and have drinks and prepare and whatever they want to do if they want to sleep and then get a few beers. It's all good. It's all good. They can do it down here. What other workshops would I put down here? Uh, my tailor shop. That's going to go down here. You buy some clothes. Uh, butcher shop. It's all going to go down here. Jewelers. This is going to be basically my main area. This is going to be... Sort of a working area. I, I should have done it the other way around, really, but it doesn't really matter. Oh, and it started raining. Is there any animation for rain at the moment? Uh, I can't see any. I don't know what if rain affects anything. 
all these crates are almost done now, which is really good. And hopefully they'll be completely empty, like such as this one. <laughs> There's a few in that, that's okay. Okay, so they've got a whole load of digging to do. Oh, some more clay, this is good, this is good. Oh wow, they dig out dirt so fast, I didn't expect it to be done that quick. Okay, I will assign some massive areas here, and then I will delete the ones up top, and I'll move everything down. Um, I think that it'll be it for this episode. Oh, I've got a lot done, I've spoke a lot. Please do check out um, the guy's website who made my intro because it is a good intro and it's it's taken me for ages to find someone to make one that is a decent standard and just make sure you give him some appreciation. Subscribe to him. Also subscribe to me because I'm almost at 100 now and when I hit 100 I'm going to do an hour long special on either this or Pokemon. Um, I think that's everything that I need to say for this episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed it, and goodbye.